click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, now we are going to discuss the example based on PLA. Let's start with the example. So your example is Design the following functions using PLA. Functions are f1 equals to f1 equals to x1 x2 plus x1 x3 bar plus x1 x2 bar and f2 equals to x1 x2 plus x1 bar x3 plus x1 x3 now we have to implement all these two functions with the use of pla the most important point you have to remember here is and gate and or gate both gate are programmable with the use of this concept you can design the circuit for the given functions so now we will design the circuit now here input variables are what x1, x2 and x3 and complements are also present in the following functions. So we will draw like this. This is your first input x1. The complement of the x1 will give you this way. Next input is x2. The complement of x2 will give you in this way then we have x3 and the complement of this will give you like this this is your x1 bar x2 bar and x3 bar with the use of and gate and or gate you have to realize the given circuit of pla so we will draw here and gate First term is x1, x2. So we will draw one line and we have to cross for x1 and x2. In this way, you have to make the connections for each AND term. Next term is x1, x3 bar. So again, we will draw one more AND gate. We will make a cross over x1 and x3 bar. After that, we have x1, x2. So in this way, we can make x1 and then x2 bar. After that, we have x1, x2. We have already one AND gate available. Then we will concentrate on x1 bar x3. So we are going to search for x1 bar and x3. After that we have x1, x3. So we will draw one line here x1 and x3. In this way you have to draw the AND gates as per the requirement. Now after drawing the AND gate how many output functions are there you have to see so two number of output functions are there and for that we will require two or gates this is for f1 and this is for f2 now you have to focus on function 1 that is f1 we want x1 x2 that is this term so we will mark cross sign then x1 x3 bar so we have x1 x3 bar so again we make a cross after that we have x1 x2 bar this is your x1 x2 bar so again cross mark now for f2 what we will write x1 x2 so this way we want to make a cross x1 bar x3 so here 
x1 bar x3 so we want this term after that x1 and x3 so x1 and x3 this gives you the final and term in this way you have to make a programmable and or structure for implementing the two functions of PLA that is programmable logic array this is the final implementation regarding PLA thank you for watching this video stay tuned with ikeda and subscribe to ikeda